Since Ukraine has gotten back on top on the ground, Russia, whose military weaknesses have been brought to light, has adopted a cynical strategy that targets civilian infrastructure to bring Ukraine to its knees. For each of your country's victories on the ground, Russia's cowardly response is to bomb power, gas or water infrastructure necessary for the people's survival this winter with a clear goal. To respond to military defeats, to spread terror among civilians. Right now, the urgency is to support the Ukrainian people's capacity to resist. To allow Ukraine to go through this long winter, together we want to organize this conference called Standing with the Ukrainian People, and we wanted the results to be very concrete. These airstrikes openly targeting the Ukrainian population and civilian infrastructure, these strikes whose, Russia admitted, only purpose was to undermine the Ukrainian people's resistance, amount to war crimes. They violate, without any doubt possible, the most fundamental principles of humanitarian law. These acts are unacceptable and will not remain unpunished. I want to be clear, in this context, it is up to Ukraine the victim of the aggression to decide on the conditions of a fair and sustainable peace.